Test, test, one, two, three. <coughs> test, test, one, two, three. Good morning, everyone. Wow, that's weird to say. Um, hope everyone is having a wonderful... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Tuesday everywhere around the world. Well, I guess Wednesday also, possibly. Is it still Monday anywhere? Maybe not. Anyways, good morning everyone. It is currently 6.10 a.m. here on the east coast of the United States, specifically Boston area. Um, it is uh, Tuesday, September 20th, 2022. Um, I went for a little bit of a jog this morning, and then I ate cake. <clears throat> so, yeah, I probably took in way more calories than I burned off this morning. Anyways, um, it's cold outside. It's 58 degrees. I'm literally jogging in a winter coat. But anyway, um, I figured I would do a little bit of Genshin. Uh, I forgot to do my Genshin last night, so yeah, I'm just going to, uh, there we go, I'm just going to go do my artifact farming, and maybe some ley lines, because there's a new ley line event, which is good, because I am definitely low on Mora. <coughs> against Electrofolk. Uh, freeze team? I could. Geo, I suppose. Uh, this team that wouldn't quite work. Um, that team probably wouldn't work very well either. Um, hmm, Cryo and... <coughs> share. We'll try this out. The slimes. Guys. Orders given. Orders received. Let's beat up the sky first. Considering she's using a three-star weapon, I think she's doing pretty decent melee game. Oh, well, okay. As long as I don't do something like that. Uh, let's see, is anyone healed? Oh, okay, no one's hurt. Hey, Brandy! Hello, hello! I don't usually stream this early in the morning, but I went to bed really early last night. So I kind of missed out on doing my Genshin farming for the day, yesterday, so I'm trying to make sure I do that this morning. Ooh, nice! Three five-star artifacts. Something good? Nope. Some, uh, nope. Something good? Crit rate uh, with attack recharge in the end? Okay, we'll save it. And then... Uh, Geo Goblet with attack and crit? 
Okay, we'll save that too. Um. <clears throat> oh, is my... Oh, I didn't realize I was speaking that low. Don't save this charge attack. Maybe that would be interesting. Uh, hold on. Uh, no. 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 I still don't have a dinjo goblet. It's very frustrating. Yay! <coughs> How are you doing this morning? Are you up late or up early? For me, I am up early. Bum, 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 bum. But I am enjoying using my physical DPS story. She is equipped right now with a uh, debate club. Um, I know it's only a three star, but I like it until I find something better for her. Um, and I'm using four piece pale fl pa bleh, four piece pale flame set because Dory uses pale flame very well. Her elemental skill can get can trigger the full two stacks of um, the four piece set bonus uh, in a single elemental skill usage. So you know. Well, not many characters can actually pull that off in a single elemental skill. Sometimes they have to, like, use multiple elemental skills to get that ramped up. But not Dory. She can do it all in a single skill use. So that's why I really like her with Pale Flame. Stabilize. <clears throat> but they have a new leyline uh, event where you can get double the money from the money getting leylines, which is really good because I am so poor. I have like a million mora, and that's it. Okay, crit rate and attack percent, good enough to meet my copium standards. Uh, okay, that's bad. Uh, let's see here. Nope. Mm, nope. 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 Oh, there we go. Ba -ba -dum. Mm. <coughs> Stretch. <coughs> Goes on. 
This guy pushes me all over the place. Okay, I have to admit, him being that forceful and being able to push me around like that? Kinda hot, gotta say. is really nice because uh, that means that rather than getting 60,000 per um, money ley line, you get 120,000 and you can do that three times so uh, at the double rate. So you can get 360 more a, a day from uh, the, the event rather than 120 a day. No. No, rather than Sorry, rather than 180 a day, you can get 360 a day. Come on, come on. Hope for some nice artifacties. Nice artifactos. Ooh, hello. HP with yeah, probably not useful to me. Huh. Maybe useful. It's kind of really copium, but it might be useful for someone like Yelan. Okay, we have an one last condensed resin. <coughs> <coughs> You're poor? I'm poor. Oh, uh, how much more do you have? Right now I have a uh, one million eighteen thousand six hundred seventy one more. Get back for you. Go. Sacred name. Fortune preserver. Where's the where, where's the other guy? I lost track of the other guy. Life goes on. Hey, guy without funny. Hello, hello. Yeah, but, you know, a lot of the, actually every uh, Dory build guide I've seen basically says you take Dory, you give her, like, um, uh, like a, a healing set, 
or a yeah, pretty much like a healing set or recharge or um, like two piece healing, two piece recharge. Uh, oh, I say you know, follow if you want to follow. Don't follow if you don't want to. It's completely up to you. I appreciate it, but uh, you know. Follow who you like. But one of the things I like about... Oh, puppies! Oh, and a kitty cat too. You need more cats though. But... So people usually like focus on her burst because her elemental burst uh, provides off... can provide off-field healing and energy regeneration to the active character. It also does a little bit of elemental uh, electro damage um, if you can put your active character between the lamp and the um, uh, uh, put the enemy between the lamp and you or your active character. But I actually like going with four piece pill. Oh. Oh. I said, puppy is cute, and you have a cat <laughs> in, in your emojis. So I was just saying how your emo emojis look cute. Um, but I actually like using four-piece pale flame set on her. Um, the reason why I like it is that, number one, when you look at when you look at uh, uh, Dory's normal attack talent numbers, they're actually like, for a, a, compared to other four star Claymore users, these are actually really high. They're basically, she's basically tied in first place with Razor for uh, damage numbers, or damage percent numbers. Um, Technically, razors, like, first hit and last hit numbers are, like, about 1% higher than Dory's, but it's, like, you know, a 132, at, uh, at level 6 talents, like, razors is, like, a 132% on the first hit compared to Dory's 131, and her, uh, razors' last hit number is, uh, 187 compared to... Dory's 186. So Dory has really good uh, melee, uh, uh, normal attack uh, talent values. So I'm like, for a four star. Of course, five star Claymore users will have higher uh, values. But compared to other four stars, she's basically on top with Razor. Um, Technically, Razor is just slightly on top of her, and I did not mean to make that sound sexual. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, um, so I'm like, okay, she's got really good melee values for a four-star character. Her elemental burst, you, the damage is terrible on it, so there's no point in raising this up for damage. It does provide some healing, but, you know, with shielders being around and skilled players being able to um, dodge attacks, you don't really need healing all that often. And to be honest, her healing is good, but not great. Like, uh, there are other healers who do a better job than her. Um, on the healing front, um, so you could <clears throat> you could build f to boost the healing on here. Now her burst does also provide energy regeneration. However, uh, you can't really build her for energy generation. Like you know, you're giving her more 
energy recharge does not help her as an off-field energy recharger uh, or regener. Um, neither does improving her HP percent or her attack. Her stats don't matter. So pretty much in my case, you know, unless I, the only thing that helps her energy regeneration is the actual talent level. So you can't improve the energy regen. You, improving the damage is not really that great. And you can kind of improve, you, you can definitely improve her healing, but yeah. So I figure why focus on her burst when you can focus on what she's also great at, at least compared to other four stars. And that's her uh, normal attack values. That's why I went with four piece pale, uh, four piece pale flame set. Additionally, what's really great is that her elemental skill can easily, uh, consistently with a single use, get the full four piece effect of the Pale Flame set, because the Pale Flame set uh, is stack based uh, for the four piece, and you need two stacks, and it can trigger both stacks at once, rather than needing multiple elemental skill usages to uh, get both stacks you need. So, yeah. I think she's great as a physical melee. How are you guys doing? I hope you have, you're all having a great Tuesday morning. Ooh. Uh, not great, but it does have recharge. It has something useful for an offset. HP percent, ooh, it's crit and EM. Okay, we'll save that. <coughs> nope, nope, nope. I still need a Dinjo Goblet and it refuses to give me one. I'm so sad. Oh wells. Okie dokie. We have done all our artifact farming, but there's still this uh, Leyline Overflow event, and we definitely need the, mo the money. Bum, 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 bum. Double the drop. Oh. Let's see here. Where are... Oh, here's a better location. <coughs> Hello, my walking... Sources of Mora. You can't run. We are alive. I will say I do wish her reach were better, but other than that. Replenish. Yeah, sure, we'll use this. Yay, 120 more. Uh, 120,000 more. Rather than the usual 60. Next. Okay. 
Okay, well, let's go after that one, too. Oh, hey, Brandy. You're here venting to Ferris about his uncle lying about how much you pay rent first. He said he wouldn't last you a hundred. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Randy. <coughs> well, I hope you guys are able, will be able to work everything out. No, that's not going to work against these guys. I will have order. Solidify. Judgment. Go. Yes, where, where, where's the, where, where, where? Oh, it's bugs. Okay. Stabilize. Yeah. Chen. Good morning. Are you up early or are you up late? <clears throat> I am up early because I went to bed really early last night. I was just so tired. I think between the move... And the start of the semester, and the K-pop dance class I'm in, uh, that, uh, I just felt a bit worn out. <laughs> Haven't slept in... Oh, pain. I'm sorry to hear... Wrong character. I thought I'd switched. But yes, physical DPS story is great. I love her. And I love this double m Mora. <laughs> anyway. Uh, did I no, no, I didn't exchange you. Wasn't there another thing? Thing right here somewhere? Or did I already forget? Okay, maybe I'm just saying things. Uh, let's see here. So I should have gone from 1 million to about 1.36 million more now. Roughly. Uh, let's see here. 
1.38. Yes, nice, 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 nice. Very good, very good. We finally got the meds we were supposed to have gotten last week, so hopefully things will look up soon. I really hope you feel much better soon, Lost. Now, let's see here about the artifactos we've gotten. Um, I'm working on leveling up Fischl's artifacts. Unfortunately, some of the artifacts I've picked up are absolute trash. Uh, which one was really bad? Uh, uh, yeah, this thundering fear. No, no, no. Was it that one? Oh no, it was like this one. This one rolled a lot of flat defense and a lot of flat HP. Burp. And, uh... Uh... Let's see... This one rolled a bit of flat defense and a lot of defense HP. Uh, defense percent. So, yeah, I haven't had very good luck with my artifacts. Yeah, I like physical builds. Um, I know that physical is definitely not meta, but, uh, you know, I, I like having some melee -ers. Um... Like, you know, for some of my characters, just for convenience, because I don't want to have to worry about setup, I'll use, like, my physical mailers will use two-piece Pale Flame, two-piece Chivalry, so you get the 50% physical damage bonus. Like, that's the case with, uh, um, that's the case I have with my, um, um, Eula. I also did that with, uh... Oh, yeah, I, I, I always build physical damage traveler just because I don't want to have to set up, you know, an artifact set when she's a Nemo or a different artifact set when she's Electro and another artifact set when she's Dendro or another when she's Geo. I just figure, you know, no matter what build I have, or no matter what element I'm using for a Traveler, you know, physical damage works on her all the time. <laughs> so, yeah. I, rather than having to build four, five, six, seven different el uh, uh, artifact sets depending on her elements, I just stick with physical damage. And that way I never have to change her out. Um, I also use, uh, physical damage gene, uh, using 2 piece chivalry, 2 piece pale flame. Uh, who else do I use physical damage on? Um, bu -bu 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 -bum. I'm using Gladiator for peace on Razor. Oh, I do use uh, two piece Pale Flame, two piece Chivalry on uh, on my Zinian. But that's because you know four piece Pale Flame would be great if it's easy to trigger to get the full two stacks quickly. But for Zinian, it can be tough because, you know, Zinian's, you need to hit 
at least two opponents with the skill just to get the uh, the damage version of her shield. And then you have to wait for the shield to tick um, again to get the four piece pale flame set bonus. Um, ba -ba 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 -bum. Uh, yeah, so, but I like that, I, actually, I love that Dory can easily trigger the, both stacks for the four-piece Pale Flame set with a single skill use. So, yeah, I love her for that. She's very convenient that way. Um... Actually, some of what I'm trying to figure how I want to build is my, um, uh, is my Sayu. Because, you know, Sayu is an Nemo character, so it can kind of make sense to use four-piece Viridescent Venera on her. But she's also a Claymore user, and I kind of like swinging Claymores around, so I kind of want to give her physical damage. But I also want her, uh, I also want her, uh, Anemo and Swirly abilities to work well. So I've kind of built a weird compromise build for my Sayu. My Sayu is actually using four-piece, uh, no, sorry, two-piece Bloodstained Chivalry, two-piece Pale Flame for the 50% physical damage bonus. And she has 793 Elemental Mastery to get the Swirl damage bonuses. So, yeah, she's kind of... all over the place. <laughs> I guess you could call her, you know, so-so uh, at everything, but a master of none? I don't know. I probably really should get her four-piece Spiritist and and just let her be an Nemo character. I mean, sorry, an Nemo Swirler. Or I should make her a uh, dedicated claymore user. Or I I don't I don't know I don't know. I have questions on her. Her her normal attack talents are kind of low. Uh, at least you know not as high as Razor's or Dory's. Um, her anemo damage is kind of eh, well okay her her skill damage isn't so bad but her burst damage is kind of eh, but it's it does damage it does healing I I don't know I don't know I don't know what to do with her it's hard to find something to focus on she's not the best melee She's not the best healer. She's not the best swirler unless you're in her skill. Um. <laughs> Maybe when she has more constellations, she'll be interesting. Um. Let's see. Yeah, pretty much it seems like that they want her to be in her fufu windmill st state most of the time. Um, let me see here. I guess. Yeah, so. Since her skill seems to be her, well, best damaging move, I suppose you could either do four-piece Viridescent Venerer, or use two-piece Viridescent Venerer, and then two-piece uh, that gives you an attack bonus, or maybe even 
uh, what, what effects that's it called? Um, the one that gives you like a 20% skill bonus. Um, um, uh, what are they called? What are they called? I forgot what they're called. Um, um, darn it. What are they called? There's a set. It's a four star set, but there's a. Is it this one? No, no, that's charge attacks. Is it. Uh, um, I'm looking, I'm looking. Not, not one of those. Well, yeah, there's a four, there's a four star set that gives you like plus 20% elemental skill damage. Maybe that would be good on her? I don't know. Oh, but right, right, right. I was going to level up using some of the artifacts which picked up today. This guy. Bop, bop. No multipliers. Still no multipliers. Oh well. Oh wait, 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 I don't need to spend all that. I can spend that. Come on! Something with crit. Something with crit. Oh well. <sighs> but, yeah. Created another universe. Fifty-nine percent crit rate, one thirteen crit damage, one twenty-five recharge, sixty-one electro. Yeah, at some point I really should try to upgrade her circlet because it rolled HP, flat HP, and flat defense a lot. And her, yeah, and her, uh, uh, sands. I'm using an off key sands, but yeah, it rolled flat defense and a lot of defense percent. So, if we can find a way to upgrade that. Actually, let's see, do we have something that we can upgrade to? Attack percent. Here, what are our options? Compare. No, I lose a lot of crit rate doing that. How about you? No, lose a lot of crit damage. Alright. Bum 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 bum. Ideally. Can find something with crit rate and crit damage in it. Um. No, and a lot of EM too would be nice. Okay, so far I'm not well uh that might work. Okay, so we have one potential piece. Oh, we have two potential pieces. Both from Maidens as off piece sets. Um What else do we have here? Okay, so we got these two as opportunities. Um, which do you want to try first?
Let's try this one first. And see where this takes us. I have not seen a times five artifact uh, uh, artifact bonus before in quite a while. So it'd be nice to get one eventually. Low HP, huh? Okay. Uh, mm, I'm kind of afraid of destroying the one I have. Actually. Uh, do, do, do I do I chuck it? Do I chuck something else? Um, I'm trying to see if there's anything else I want to chuck first as a feeder. First, let's see what it looks like at plus eight. Maybe it gets better. Come on, come on, come on. God, why? This is not looking great. <sighs> Let's see how it looks at higher level. Come on, give me something good, please. That's so short. Come on, just some... Ah, oh, no multipliers. Oh. Okay, come on, crit. Come on, crit. Come on, crit. Okay, okay. There's hope for you yet. Thanks, you bonus, alright. Come on. Uh, what if you did? Okay, come on, times two. No. Okay, come on, crit, 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 right, crit, right, crit, right. Crit, damn, okay. <laughs> that was a 6.2%. Uh, it has a chance. No, oh, hmm, let me see here. At the moment, let me see, how does it currently compare? Right now, my existing one has 5.1 more percent crit rate, so that's... 10.2 more crit value, minus the 7, so right now it's uh, from a 10.2, it's a 3.2 higher crit value. Uh, so the only way that this artifact can beat mine is if it rolls another crit stat in terms of crit value. Um, hmm. 
What are the odds of that? What are the odds of that? Uh, my plan today? Go and, uh, TA two recitations of a class. Uh, do a little bit more work on my dissertation. Because mm, I'd like to eventually get my PhD. <laughs> um, Hmm, is there anything else I want to feed this thing? In hopes of getting lucky? Uh, let's see here. Why am I saving that? I don't know. Yes, I have a lot of partially enhanced artifacts banked, just in hopes of eventually being able to use someday. Um, let's see here, anything I can get rid of here? Probably feed that. That's fine. Mm. How much more? Uh, how, sorry, how much? Oh, okay, I'm at 20 there. Okay, I know what I'll do. I will go here. Oh, whoops. Spend 50 Prima Gems to get 60 Resin that I can then trade in. Nope. For two Condensed Resins. And then from there, I will go back and artifact just a little bit more. Okay. So I've been using physical dory for the last several fights. Let's go to someone different. Okay, we will use our geo team. Though, I don't think they're particularly effective against Electro Shields, but just for a little variety. Coming to be, feel the same power. Has a good night, Should. 
looking for both. Uh, well, just good artifacts in general. What we really need are Denjo goblets. Come on, Denjo goblet? Nope. Well, at least we got good feeding fodder, I suppose. That's... <sighs> yep. But we want feeding fodder, we want Denjo goblets. And just good artifacts in general. Um, um, um. Get close. I will have order. Charge! Everyone on me! Then feel the same uh. power. <laughs> As a dutiful made one. Oh wow, that's terrible too. <laughs> oh, but you look nice. We will save you. Any Denju Calvert? No. Okay. I tell you, Denju goblets are a myth. I have yet to see one. No, I've seen one. In all this time that I've been farming artifacts, since Rio came out, I've seen a Denju goblet once, and it was a four star. And it was a two liner four star. <sighs> this game does not want me to have Denju goblets. I'm using attack goblets on my two Denju archers. Osmanthus uh, wine tastes the same as I remember. But artifacts. I forget what was I leveling up? Osmanthus wine tastes the oh, right, same right, as I right, right. Yeah, I remember. I was leveling up someone's attack thingy. It must have been an attack percent sands, right? Oh, right, right, right. It was, it was, it was. Hoping that I can get something better than what I'm currently using. A small chance, but a chance. What's this game? Oh, this is Genshin Impact. Okay, tomorrow or maybe later tonight, we'll be able to raise this thing up to 20. But I am now out of resin. But where are those who share the memory? Yep. I guess I can just do my daily commissions. Mm. 
Klavier. Teleport. Switching to my physical damage and superconducting. Every journey has its final day. Don't rush. <laughs> Time trial, huh? You can't run. Life goes on. Thank you. Three more to go. Ooh, an artifact though. An artifact though. Huh? Gave me a time speed bonus on the single thing, but okay. At least it's in the 19 range. Uh, let's see here. Alright. We would like to find more artifacts, but we have no resin. Resin. Where did it go? I do not know. I to find some more artifacts. Time to go stabilize. You can't run. Life goes on. Now you're testing my patience. Light chasing, okay.
People actually do the uh, the, the primo gem redemption for uh, you know, turning in primo gems in order to get resin. Whatever floats your boat, Randy. Okay, we're supposed to investigate the ship. still have more? Is there still one out there that I'm not seeing off the top of my head? Oh, no, oh, no, no, I, I, I can see the show. Okay, okay. Adventurer's Guild, here we come. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. Catherine, I think you're going to get killed next patch. Or next update. At least at that Thank you for completing 3.1 trailer is any indication. Is if they kill you, does that mean we can't come here for commissions anymore? <laughs> okay, okay. Um, let me see here. Same as until that thing refreshes. Okie dokie. This looks like a good place to end stream. And then I can go and take a poop break. And after that, I can go and uh, get dressed and put on a little bit of makeup and head out to do my TA session this morning. Guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today, this morning. I'll probably be back on this evening. Um, I've got a little bit of school Where stuff do to do, teeing a couple if classes. Like to see spots, I have Let a me see if I can find someone to read. The one that I know is paying attention right now. Um, uh, no, no one I know is on this morning. <laughs> oh well. Um, okay, guys, have a good one. Mm -hmm. Until next time. Bye for now. <laughs>